Hello, this video is to help you learn how to create a student center using the Smart Notebook software for your smart board. This is an example of a student center created for a second grade class learning um, and reviewing ordinal numbers. Students are taught to click on the images that have become links to other pages within the notebook. They can complete the activity using the smart board pens or whatever the activity may require, and then return home if time allows for them to complete another activity. There are also options that link them to websites outside of the notebook page for them to complete an activity on the web. This video has been created to help you create your own student center linking files within the same notebook uh, file or using links to the um, to the internet so here is our new student center creating links for student centers what we're going to do here is we are going to create a link within the file so I am going to type game. This is going to be my new link to the second page which I've already created an activity for the smart board. Clicking on with your left click, uh, clicking on the word game, you get a little arrow. This arrow will allow you to come down and link. Once you're here, you're going to choose a page in this file. Now, the second page was the page that had the game that I had created. Down here at the bottom, we want the entire object, the word game, to be the link. So I'm going to click Object. Click OK. It's as easy as that. I have nothing up on the screen. I go over to the word game. I click it. And it takes me to the next page. When you're on full screen view, all you have to do is click it. And it will come up with your activity. Now, for students, it is the best thing for the best thing for you to do is to create some sort of icon down here in the corner for home. What I'm just going to create is just the word home. You can use an image for this as well. I'm going to link it to a page in the file, page one, the one we started with, the object I want that to be available. Click OK, and there we've created two links in less than 30 seconds. I click the home link and I'm back to where I started. As I said before, you can also choose to use websites as your links as well. So I'm just going to type in the word website. That's going to be my icon to link. I'm going to click link and I'm going to choose a website. Let's use my Yola site. Come back over here. I copy and I paste. I click object and I say OK. Just that easily. I'm going to be able to connect to my YOLA site. All right. Just as easy as that. It's very simple to make a student center. Student centers can be used um, on an individual basis. And once they've been taught, uh, you can use them all year long in your classroom.